Well, new today in Tech Talk with efforts to ban TikTok in Virginia for kids under 18. Some social media experts are wondering how it will be done. But in the meantime, there are ways to control how your kids use a social media site and others starting today. We have seen this in a few other states like Utah uh, and Texas. In 2024, Governor Glenn Youngkin is working on legislation to restrict TikTok for teens. To restrict youth access, those under 18, to TikTok. But the question is, if a law is passed, will it work? Titania Jordan is the chief parent officer of Bark Technologies, an app that allows parents to monitor their kids' social media accounts. While she believes in Youngkin's mission, she says there could be loopholes. I'm very, very interested to see how it would actually be enforced, knowing that I have spoken about this sort of thing with my son, who is almost 15, and he's like, Mom, kids are just going to use a VPN. They're just going to circumvent it. They're going to find a way to get on it. She's tracking other proposals on the Hill, which could also give parents control of what their kids see and do online. What will be more effective is for things like Sammy's Law to be passed, and Sammy's Law gives parents parents the option to use third-party monitoring solutions to limit screen time and get access. As for why she thinks apps like TikTok are causing concern for some. You know, from the very light basic layer of just the comparison trap, children falling into the Wow, they're thinner than I am. They're richer than I am. They have more friends than I do. They have more engagement than I do. And as for simple steps you can take right now to protect your children online, she says, Whoever provides your internet service to your home, make sure you have reached out to their customer success or Googled the parental controls that come for free. Then you look at the device, whether it's a smart TV, a gaming console, a smartphone, a tablet, all of these different connected pieces of tech in your home, those also have parental controls. And then finally, at the app or game level, there's also built-in free parental controls, even in things like Snapchat and TikTok. 